Good morning, YouTubers. You have reached the Brian Sledge channel. Please like, subscribe, and hit the bell for notifications. Uh, thank you very much, and have a great day. Bye. Welcome to Headline News 24-7. Please click like, and subscribe. A claim she's in charge and Americans have no say, James Woods destroys her. Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez has been posting on social media and making videos from her Bronx kitchen as she cooks. In one of her more haughty moments, the former bartender told Americans that she's in charge and that we have no say and are just shouting from the cheap seats. Well, that's when conservative actor James Woods really let her have it and utterly destroyed her. You'll love this. Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez is getting a lot of heat about her Green New Deal. The 29-year-old socialist isn't taking rejection well. Over the weekend, the New York Congresswoman gave a marathon chat session to try and impress Americans with her smarts and her cooking. In a bizarre Instagram Live video, the socialist darling of the left questioned the morality behind having children when scientific consensus suggests their lives will be difficult due to the threat of global warming, the Political Insider reports. Our planet is going to hit disaster if we don't turn this ship around and so it's basically like, there's a scientific consensus that the lives of children are going to be very difficult, Ocasio-Cortez said as she prepared food for her 2.5 million followers. And it does lead, I think, young people to have a legitimate question, you know, is it okay to still have children? A wild statement such as this seems even more absurd when you consider climate change has been a phenomenon around since the Earth was formed. Here's an image of a placard at the New York State Museum in Albany which describes climatic change and global warming as being a contributing factor to the extinction of mastodons, the political insider added. But that's not all. Last Friday, the arrogant and very misguided Ocasio-Cortez riled up many Americans along with actor James Woods when she tweeted about those questioning the wisdom of her Green New Deal, yup. If you don't like the hashtag Green New Deal, then come up with your own ambitious, on-scale proposal to address the global climate crisis. Until then, we're in charge, and you're just shouting from the cheap seats. Wow, the American electorate is just shouting from the cheap seats? That's really rich coming from the bartender-turned-congresswoman who just has weeks of experience under her belt. From the maven from the Bronx who claimed she was just a regular citizen who promised her people their voices would be heard. Well, James Woods had something to say to Walk, and we bet she didn't like it one bit. Woods pounded her by responding, So, you may have missed this, but the way it works in America is you work for U.S. The last time somebody told Americans to sit down and shut up was 1776. If you ever learn to read, look it up. You are not only an idiot, you're an arrogant idiot, and there is nothing more dangerous. Making matter worse, the unhinged congresswoman also claimed lawmakers are going to kill us if the savior of climate change doesn't get her way. This idea that I've been working on this for X amount of years, um, it's like not good enough, Ocasio-Cortez said. Like, we need a universal sense of urgency, and people are like trying to introduce watered-down proposals that are frankly going to kill us. A lack of urgency is going to kill us. There's no doubt Oc has captured one record in Congress, making the most idiotic statements by a sitting U.S. representative. You'd be hard-pressed to find this amount of pure bullcrap coming from one congressman's mouth within the first few months in office. We've concluded she's amusing in a maddening kind of way. But is she dangerous? You bet she is. Uck has a huge following among millennials and low-information voters who think she is the answer to America's problems. Here's hoping her lackluster performance in getting anything done for her constituents will cause them to vote her out. Until then, we are stuck having to endure one of the most ignorant congresswomen we have seen since Maxine Waters took office over 30 years ago. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.